Hey guys, welcome back to my channel and if you're new, I'm Brooklyn. So today I'm going to be doing my jewelry collection. Um, I really love jewelry. I love the way that you can spice up an outfit with it and just add to your overall presentation and make you a lot more put together than maybe you actually are. But yeah, so I've accumulated a good collection of jewelry over the years and I just wanted to share with you guys what I have. I'll link everything in the description box that I have links to because some of the things might be older or might not have like the exact same thing still. But I'll link some similar ones so that you guys can buy anything that you are interested in if you want to. I'll do my best. But then other than that, I'll put all of the brands on the screen so that you know where I got them from. And yeah, so let's just get into the video. Okay, so I think I'm just gonna start with my like everyday jewelry. Um, I keep it in this and I just set it like on the side of my jewelry box. Um, and my aunt actually made this. It's so pretty. Um, it's just like a dish and it has like, it's like made out of resin and it just has like crystals and stuff. I don't think she's making them right now still because she's pregnant, but when she does start making them again, you guys should definitely check out her Etsy. I'll leave it in the description and I could put like her name up here. So I keep my everyday jewelry in here. Um, I don't have a necklace in here just cause I pick whatever necklace like fits with that day. But um, I have all of my rings and then I have my bracelet. So I feel like this is a controversial topic and I don't know like how everybody feels about it, but I, um, I mix my gold and silver jewelry. I don't know, I just like always mix them together just cause I really like both of them and I can never choose like solid, like silver all across or gold all across just because I like them both. So for my first gold pieces, I just got these for Christmas. I needed some more gold rings that would like last a long time and that were good quality and didn't tarnish like super fast. So these three and they're like very pretty. I love them so much and they look really nice and high quality. There's this one with like diamonds in it and then I have this one that kind of looks like a seashell or something. Um, yeah, I really like that one. And then I have this one that has like a flat thing. And then for my everyday bracelet, I have this one from Tiffany. Oh, it's just like this chain link. Um, what do you call that? Oh, I'm like, I don't know what do you call that. Like a pendant? No, like a, a charm. Yeah. And then I have a Tiffany ring that I always wear on my thumb. It just has the T and Co. I don't know if you can even see that, but I'll do like a close up of everything. This one's like really special. Um, I got this when my mom and my stepdad got married as part of like symbolism for like our family and stuff. And um, it just has all the initials of me, my mom, my stepdad, and then my sister and our initials spell able. So these next three were like a part of a set that are from Urban Outfitters. They're like tarnishing, but I still wear them because I love them. But um, you just wear them like you can stack them. So I usually wear like two of them per finger or whatever. There's like a really simple one um, with nothing on it and then there's one with like diamonds that make like a star. And then um, I have this birthstone ring that has like my birthstone. I was born in August, so it's like Peridot or Peridot. I don't know how you even say it, but it's really pretty. That is it for my everyday jewelry. And now I will show you what's in the box. So I have this whole set of um, hoops that are like really pretty. So there's just like all different sizes. I wear the medium ones most of the time. I've never worn the bigger ones just cause they're like that like chunky gold hoop. It can be like really heavy on your ears and I'm just like not used to that. They're really nice. Um, they haven't like tarnished at all just cause I like try to take really good care of them, but um, I'm sure they would, but I would definitely recommend them. The next pair that I have are actually from Brandy. I got these like a really long time ago. They're super cute and dainty. They're just like a very small little hoop and um, they have stars on them. I really like the dangly, but like hoop ones. Um, I have these, these are super cute. I'm pretty sure these are from Depop. Okay, so for more bracelets, um, I have like a lot of Alex and Annie bracelets. Um, like a lot. <laughs> so the first one that I have is 
this one that says sister on it and then i have this one that says thankful on it and that one was probably like for thanksgiving or something and then i have this one with a b on it and it has like gold on the outside but the silver b and then I have this one that says granddaughter. And then I have this daisy one. It's really pretty. And then I have this one that says New York City on it. I think this one's probably my favorite one. It has like the apple on the outside. And then it has like a New York um, skyline view in the inside. This one that has another bee on it. It's just silver. And then I have this one that has like a sailor anchor in it. It's super cute. And then I have this bracelet that's like super pretty. My friend got this for me. Um, I literally love it. It just like tightens around your arm. It's very pretty. It just has like these stone diamonds in it. And it like dangles. It's very pretty. And then I have another bracelet from Tiffany that's just this like beaded dainty little bracelet and then it has like a really tiny please return to tiffany charm it's super cute i love this one so much i just got this for christmas and i absolutely love it okay so on to necklaces the first one i'll show you guys is this one i just got this for christmas it's like a layered gold necklace it's so pretty i literally love it it's got like one layer with a star on the left and then one layer with a star on the right. And then this is like my favorite necklace right now. I love this so much. Um, I bought this one myself off of um, Depop, like a vintage resale shop. And it's Dior. It just has like two little diamonds on the end and then has the CD logo and then this next one i got from my stepdad i think it was like right when my parents like were about to be engaged i went and helped him pick out the ring for my mom from tiffany I got this for me like before like when he told me that he was going to propose to her which is really sweet um so yeah it just has like the tiffany heart and then this one i got myself too um i forget what the place is called um, I'll definitely link it, but I love this so much. It's like gold and then it has like the butterfly charm with like the stone in the middle um, with this green color. This green is like my favorite. And then the next piece I have is another Tiffany necklace. It goes with like the bracelet. It's like the same like chain link thing and then it has just the clasp here and then the return to Tiffany. And then this, I think I got this in Monterey. Um, it's so pretty. It just has like a two little like circles linked together. And the last piece that I have is this necklace that my grandparents got me from Alaska. It has the Alaska um, outline. So that is my jewelry collection. I really hope you guys enjoyed and I will make sure I have everything linked below and hopefully you can go buy some of these really cute pieces also. They're all super pretty and dainty and I definitely recommend every piece that I have. They're all really nice and really good quality. And yeah, so thanks so much for watching. I'll see you in the next video. Bye.